Okay, hello. <laughs> this is Anna Lee, and this is the digital badging for the Claret, the 25 millimeter Claret. Um, so the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to rinse off the Claret. In order to do so, we're just going to pour some water in the top. So this stock clock at the bottom is parallel to the ground, which means that it's just So that means I can pour water in and it will be out with the temperature. So I'm just going to pour some water in. I'm going to dispense something with the tip just to make sure that it's working well and also to make it out a little bit and get any bubbles in. And then I'm going to swirl it around the top to get any of the larger water particles um, off of the edge of it. My hand keeps like sliding down the top. Okay, and then we're just going to rinse it one more time. So 
in order to determine the amount of volume that has been dispensed in the early Myers labs, we just subtracted it, right? So the difference between 20.65 and 19.25 is 1.40 milliliters. So that means we dispense 1.40 milliliters into the early Myers lab. That's not to say that originally we started with like 19.25 milliliters of solution. That's just the reading, but in order to find the actual volume of solution inside the burette, we would subtract that number from 25. So the original reading was 19.25 milliliters, meaning that the actual volume was 5.75 milliliters, right? And then our second reading was 20.65, which means that the actual volume that's still left here in the burette is 4.35 milliliters of solution. Um, so, yeah, I think that's it. Thank you.